one question, Kelly! Who am I? The MC. What's up? What's up? Let me break that down. What's up? Beautiful spirits, pugilist fanatics. This is Myron Magnus of Boxing Logics United. Andy Ruiz Jr. Let's label this video Dear Andy. And I want to talk sincerely to you, young bro. Right now, you're looking like a defeated first time Mexican heavyweight champion of the world. You look like a defeated first time heavyweight champion of the world. The energy that you are exuding leading up to this rematch is going to hurt you more than it help you. It's going to hurt you much more than it helps you. You are the first heavyweight champion of the world of Mexican lineage. And all this stalling is to make you look like the first heavyweight champion of the world that would be a Mexican chicken, a Mexican ducker. Do you understand that? You have, you are, should I say, the unified heavyweight champion of the world. The first to do that of Mexican lineage. And you are, or will be, put in the forefront of all Mexican fighters by having that position. Yet, you're going to make Mexico and Mexican Americans ashamed by the way you're acting. And you're probably going to most likely make them wish you had never won the title in the first place. See, what I think is you're stalling, stalling, stalling. And the game plan is to kill the hype and momentum of this fight. So Eddie Hearn, Dazen, Mashroom, Joshua just throw in the bags, right? And then somehow, some way, you can retain the belts. And Heyman can have an undisputed unified match between you and Deontay. A lot of people, a lot of rumors thinking that's what you guys are trying to conspire behind the scenes. But Andy, it's not going to turn out that way. You are in jeopardy of becoming the Mexican Tyson Fury. Do you understand that? You are in jeopardy of becoming the Mexican Tyson Fury. Now Tyson Fury was able to bounce back and I'm happy for him. But can we say the same for you? Are you sure that will be the same for you after or as or say if you're stripped of these belts from not following through with this fight? December 7th on Saudi Arabia you do not know what the future holds whoever the advisors in the back scenes ah! pardon me whatever the advisors are saying in the back scenes of course we don't know we can only speculate whatever they're telling you they cannot guarantee there is no guarantees Okay, in this world. But one thing is for sure, Andy Ruiz Jr. If you fight in Saudi Arabia, December 7th, 
win or lose, your name will be intact. You've made history. Win or lose, your pride, your dignity, integrity will be intact. But if you do not follow, follow through with the date, without all this crying, posturing, wearing shades now, because it's probably becoming hard to look people in the eyes and show your face. If you do not follow through, bro, you will become an Aztec disgrace. Follow your trainer. The words of Manny Robles is, we are champion, we are have a contract, pardon me. We have a contract binding. We must adhere to this contract. We are champion of the world, and he is, and we are willing to fight anywhere. Now, Manny Robles sounds like a real, real Mexican pride trainer. Now, only thing he needs is for his Mexican pride for fighter to step up to the plate and try to repeat history. Because right now, it looks like you don't believe you can. And everybody's starting to think you don't believe you can. This is Myra Magnus and another segment of Boxing Logics United. Like, subscribe, share. One love.